hello and welcome to my youtube channel information and technology in today's tutorial i am going to show you the shortcuts that are used in notepad the notepad application or software comes as a built-in feature with every windows or operating system you install today i'm going to show you 17 cool shortcuts that you can use while working with notepad so without wasting any time let's get started our first shortcut is Control n we use the Control n shortcut to create a new text file i'm currently working in the notepad file called shortcut key list if i want to create a new text file in the notepad i will press the Control n shortcut key on the keyboard our second shortcut is Control o the Control o shortcut key is used to open an existing text file I have just pressed the Control o shortcut now I'm going to find the text file that I want to open so I select the file and click open it will open that text file for me 3 Control s this shortcut key is used to save a new untitled text file this is my new text file in which I have written some text to save this new untitled text file, I can press the Ctrl S shortcut key on the keyboard. Choose a location where I want to save this file, give it a name and click on save. 4. Ctrl P To print a notepad text file, we use the Ctrl P shortcut key on our keyboard. This opens up the print menu. From here, we can choose our printer and click on the print button. 5. Control A We use this shortcut key to select all the content of a text file. 6. Control Z The Control Z shortcut key is used to cancel the previous action. Let's delete Welcome to Information Technology. Now, if I press the Control Z shortcut key, in the keyboard it will cancel the previous action I did 7 control X to cut a selected word sentence or a text we can use the control X shortcut key on our keyboard control V this shortcut key is used to paste the selected text for example I just cut some text now I want to paste this text I can press the Ctrl V shortcut key on the keyboard. 9. Ctrl C. We use this shortcut key to copy a selected text. To copy this text which says, Welcome to Information Technology, I must select the text first and then press Ctrl C. 10. Delete key. To delete a selected text, we can press the delete key on our keyboard 11 control F to find a word in the text file you can press the control F shortcut then write the word or text that you want to look for click on the find and as you can see it found the word we were looking for I can click find next to see other words in the text file. 12. F3 If you want to find the next word in the text file, you can simply press F3 key in the keyboard and it will take you to the next word. 13. Control H The Control H shortcut key is used to replace a text or word with another text. Let's say I want to replace the word information with info. I must press the Control H first. Write the word that I want to change. In this case, it's information. In the second box, I am going to write the word that I want to replace, which is info. Now, simply click on the Replace button. 14. Control G. This shortcut key takes us from one line to another in the text file. 15. F5. 
The F5 shortcut key is used to insert the system time and date. So, if I want to insert this time and date, instead of typing them up, I can simply press the F5 shortcut key and it will insert the system time and date for me. 16. Alt. This shortcut key highlights the menu bar. Once highlighted, then you can press the arrow keys to go from one menu to another. 17. F10. This shortcut key performs the same action as the Alt key, which means it will highlight the menu bar. That's all I have for you in this tutorial today. Thank you for watching and subscribing to my channel. Make sure you use these shortcuts. It can be very handy, especially if you are working on tight deadlines and want to provide quicker output. So, have a good day!